Here, get that little piece off. When this family of four isn't enjoying their time together outside, they're enjoying their time inside. Working on projects or tending to their cats. But Saturday morning, which was a beautiful morning, Jason Blackerby adds, he decided to go for a jog alone. Glad he did so because as he was rounding the corner of his block, he says his neighbor's two dogs came running no, right for him. Uh, surprisingly, they were pretty silent, but they, they came up and it was very clear that they weren't coming to play. Blackerby says he was able to keep one dog away, but the other apparently jumped up, latched onto his arm, and bit through three layers of clothing. We stopped by the dog owner's home. Nobody answered when we rang the doorbell, but the dog that bit Blackerby was inside. Blackerby and his wife Lisa say they don't want to think about what could have happened had it been one of their children running the block. Not only their children, but other children within the neighborhood, not even a block away since Leonard Lawrence Elementary School. Blackerby tells us oftentimes school kids will come right up to the dog owner's fence line. And he adds this isn't the first time the dog has acted out. Blackerby says it attacked one neighbor's dog and came close to attacking another neighbor. Through repeat offenses, it's, it's clear that there's an issue and it's got to be addressed. And how would you like to see that be addressed? The dog removed from the neighborhood. As for those previous incidents Blackerby was talking about, I checked with the Nebraska Humane Society and they have no proof the dog ever harmed another animal or person. I'm told the dog has since been declared potentially dangerous though, which means if it does attack again, it will be confiscated and the owner won't be allowed to own another pet in Bellevue for four years. Reporting live, I'm Jessica Gill, WOWT 6 News. Jessica, thanks. We did ask. The Humane Society tells us the dog is licensed and its vaccinations are current. It's currently on a 10-day home quarantine period. After that, the dog will be tested for rabies.